Hello. This video is a guide on what to expect and how to prepare for your domestic flight from Gold Coast Airport. People fly for different reasons. They could be going on a holiday, they could be working, they might be visiting family or friends. You are going to be travelling on a plane from Gold Coast Airport. Airports need to be safe and there are rules you will need to follow. Listen to staff carefully and follow the rules. You are flying to a place in Australia. This is called domestic travel. You will need a boarding pass to fly. If you check in online, you can have your boarding pass on your phone or printed from home. You can take things with you on your flight. Carry-on baggage is small. This will have things you need in the airport and on the plane. Checked-in baggage is a bigger bag. This bag will have things you will need for your trip when you get off the plane. Each airline has different rules. Make sure to check with your airline about their rules. Airports can be very busy. Sometimes rushing can cause people to feel stressed. It is best to give yourself one and a half hours before your domestic flight. You may feel overwhelmed when walking into Gold Coast Airport. You can go to the GCA Ambassador Information Desk for guidance. Before you go on your plane, there are things you need to do. If you have not checked in at home, you will need to do so at the airport. Look to the display boards for your airline picture. This will show you which kiosk to use. Other airlines will be shown on the display boards for a while. This is normal because airlines share kiosks with each other. Look for a kiosk with your airline picture. Other airlines will be shown on the kiosk screen. This is fine and normal. Choose your airline and follow the instructions. You will then be able to print off your boarding pass and tags for your checked-in bags. If you need help, you can talk to airline staff, airline counter staff and GCA ambassadors. If you have a checked-in bag, you will need to take it to bag drop. Attach your tags to your bag and place it onto the conveyor belt. The conveyor belt will deliver your bags to your plane. You can pick up your checked-in bags after the flight. You will then need to go through security screening. It checks that everybody is safe to fly. Join the queue and wait. You will then be asked to take off some items like belts and hats. Place your belongings in a tray. Then, walk through the scanner by yourself. There might be beeping sounds when going through screening. This is OK and normal. Listen to the security staff and you may have to go through screening again. The security officers will tell you if something is not allowed on the plane. You must leave the item at security screening. After you have been scanned, you can collect your belongings. Sometimes you may have to do another check. The security staff will use a handheld wand with a pad to touch your clothes and shoes. This is safe and normal. You might be asked to open your bag. They will touch your bag with the wand. The pad is then put into a machine and tested. This security check is quick. You may be asked to go through a body scanner. This will scan your whole body. It is a quick and normal check. Listen carefully to instructions from the security staff. After security screening, you will enter the departures lounge. This is where you wait for your plane. If it is too bright and noisy, use our sensory map to locate a space that may be less busy. 
If you have time before your flight, you can go shopping, have something to eat, or find somewhere quiet to sit and wait. Or you can go straight to your gate and wait for your plane. Your boarding pass will tell you the gate number for your flight and time to be at the gate to board your plane. You can also look at the information screens, which will give updated information about your flight. It is good to check the information screens in case your plane has been delayed or moved to a different gate. If an international flight is departing, some of the departure lounge area may be blocked off. It is OK if you are unable to get to your gate. It will be open in time for your flight. When it is time to go to your gate, tell the airline staff if you need help getting on the plane. The airline staff will tell you when you can board the plane. Join the queue and wait. When you meet the airline staff, show them your boarding pass and they will scan it. You will then walk onto the tarmac where your plane is waiting for you. It can be very loud outside and you may smell fumes from the planes. Follow the other passengers and walk up the ramp or stairs to your plane. You will be greeted by another airline staff. They will check your boarding pass. Find your seat. You may need to get up and let people pass so they can sit next to you. Follow instructions from the airline staff until you are off the plane. Enjoy your flight. Remember, if you are ever unsure of what to do or become overwhelmed at Gold Coast Airport, talk to a help desk GCA ambassador or airline staff member for assistance.